Hi, I'm Stephen Milikowski and I'm making this video for a blog demo that I'm going to start in a couple of weeks. The blog is going to be called touringonthatbike.wordpress.com. I chose the name Touring on That Bike because of a response I often hear when I've been tour uh, cycling on my, um, my favorite cycle here. Uh, I like to cycle um, 30 or 40 miles in a day whenever I can. And um, in a couple of weeks, I'm going to start cycling from Land's End to John, John and Groats, which is about a thousand miles. When I tell people about my cycling and they see my, my, my bike, they often say, you're going to tour on that bike? And that's where I get the name from. So I want to show you my bike uh, so I can add this video to the blog and also show my bike to some family back home. It's folded up here, as you might have guessed, and what, the first thing I'll do is unfold it. That's step one. Lock it down. Next, I just raise the seat up, lock that down, handlebar, locked, and next is this rotating handlebar, which is kind of one of the gadgets on this bike. So, there's the rotated handlebar locked down. Well, the first thing I'll talk about is this wire that seems to be dangling in the wind right here. This wire goes into a battery right there. This battery has a USB port so I can charge uh, a smartphone or anything else. Uh, and the power comes from the front hub, which is kind of fun. That power also generates the light, the power for the light. So the electrical system is something that's kind of fun for a touring cycle. I can recharge my iPhone, I can charge some batteries. What else can I tell you? I mentioned this front um, tilting uh, handlebar, and that's kind of fun because I can set the handlebars at different levels, rotate it to different comfort positions, and lock it back down again. Some variety there. So if I'm going in the country, I want to be down low, I put this low. If I want to uh, ride in the city and, st and stand upright, I put it higher, like that and the light is between it. As you can see, there are panniers in front and back. I have one pannier with me. I'll show you that in a second. I added this kickstand. It's kind of a durable kickstand so that I can hold the bike up when panniers are loaded. And here's one of my panniers. I'm facing the wrong angle, but you will be able to see just, just how easy that goes on. There, panniers on, no problem. Something else I want to show you is a little surprise in the seat. Looks like a regular seat. I can unscrew this cap in the seat. Flip a little switch, eventually. And I have a tire pump. I put this down, and I can pump my tires on the road. back in to the stem. Folds back down, screw this back into the uh, seat post. It's rattling only because I added a clip. It isn't that noisy usually. And this just slides back into the cycle. And that's that. Panniers, adjustable front uh, handlebar, electrical system, Special, uh, I got a special kickstand. No, I'll drop the bike. I'll, I'll unfold it. Pull the kickstand back. Put the seat down. Move the handlebars. It's kind of firm, but it should be firm. Get those straight up. Release the, the, uh, the stem. It's kind of firm to get that released as well, but firm is important when you're on a cycle. And last, there you go. Well, the pannier's still on, but I can pull that off nice and easy. And I almost forgot to mention, I have 24 gears in this cycle. So people ask me, do the little tires make a difference for cycling? Well, 24 gears, in, in, in the lowest gear, I, I can go up 
uh, not any hill, but I can go as slow as I can go, and the front tire is popping up, so I have a lot of leverage when I'm in the lowest gear. In the highest gear, I'm going about 35 miles an hour, and I'm still pushing hard, and I don't want to go any faster than 35 miles an hour. So the, the small wheels don't seem to make a lot of difference. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please keep an eye on this blog. I hope to be adding information as I cycle across the UK. And um, if you want to put a comment in the blog, I'd love to hear from you. Thanks very much.